Fly me to the moon Let me play among the stars Let me see what... Did you like that? It only took me four hours. And I thought it was necessary because Litecoin has gained 30% in 24 hours and we are living in a sea of green. I'm so Sorry about that, I got I got excited. Anyways, my portfolio is looking much better today compared to the uh, rest of the week. And in case you didn't know, I put together a $10,000 investment at the beginning of this year. And if you would like to keep up to date on how my portfolio is doing, you can follow me on Twitter or Steemit. Links are in the description. I post daily updates on how high or low my portfolio has gone. Now I'm no expert, so don't go buying pump -a dumps and start blaming me because the only dumps I'm responsible for are my own. Now you might have seen in my portfolio that I don't actually own any Litecoin, which would lead to the question as to why I'm excited about Litecoin experiencing 30% gains. Well, I might not own any, but I do mine it. Every time it goes up, I get much closer to being able to pay my electricity bill. Just so close. Now Litecoin experienced quite the pump whenever Charlie Lee tweeted this. Fungibility is the only property of sound money that is missing from Bitcoin and Litecoin. Now that the scaling debate is behind us, let the next battleground be on fungibility and privacy. I am now focused on making Litecoin more fungible by adding confidential transactions. Now to do this, they are using a protocol known as Mimblewimble. Mimblewimble is a term taken from Harry Potter, but to help explain what the Mimblewimble protocol does, I've asked my friend Google. Mimblewimble is a protocol that was put forward by an anonymous user in a Bitcoin developer's chat room by the name of Tom Elvis Deducer. Nailed it, I think. Mimblewimble itself is the name of a spell used to tongue-tie victims in Harry Potter. Deducer left a link to a white paper in which he outlines that by using the Mimblewimble protocol, the scalability as well as the privacy of the Bitcoin network could significantly be enhanced. Now let there be no confusion Litecoin is not trying to tie your tongues. They're testing out the Mimblewimble protocol so you can have private transactions. So you can use Litecoin to buy the things that you don't want anyone else to know about. Does Gary Busey therapy accept Litecoin? Perfect. Now it's time for a new segment I'm starting called It's Twitter Time! A segment where I share my favorite crypto tweets that I've come across. Now this tweet comes from Alec Zipsumsi. The bull market is where you gain more dollars. The bear market is where you gain more Bitcoin. Learn to value your wealth in Bitcoin and it becomes simple. Brilliant! 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 Now there are some environmentalists that are not a big fan of Bitcoin because of the amount of energy it uses. In fact, they had an entire conference about this. Pat Allen tweeted, if your business accepts or uses Bitcoin, stopping that is almost certainly the best thing you can do to reduce your company's carbon emissions. A Bitcoin transaction creates 205 kilograms of carbon dioxide per transaction. What was the carbon footprint of the plane she took to get to that conference? Take a sailboat next time. Now don't get me wrong, I love the planet that we live on and we should all do our part to preserve it. But I mean, come on. The carbon footprint of using your cell phone for two minutes is 47 kilograms, so why doesn't he start by not tweeting ridiculous things? But that's all I have for you today, guys. It's a short video. It seemed a lot longer when I wrote it all out, but it's a short video. But thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, hit that subscribe button and turn your post notifications on so you'll know the next time my portfolio pumps or dumps. Follow me on Twitter, link is in the description, and if you find any amazing crypto tweets, please send them my way, tweet me on Twitter, link is in the description. I'd love to check them out. I'll see you next time. Oh man, I'm gonna quit my job. These crypto